Okay, go ahead, throw. Okay, throw the next one. Okay, go get them. I think we have a natural. Nice shot. Nice shot, are you? Yeah, that's like an infill day. <laughs> that's like, yeah, that's... That was like 150 feet, probably. <laughs> oh, 
That's yeah. always a good feeling. Yeah, she just needs to keep firing at that same speed. And we see the headwind ruffling the shirt of Arya, and Udisk is telling us that she's putting for par, which means that that would have been an out-of-bounds stroke added to her card. <laughs> wow. <laughs> That's it. What a putt. And just when you think there might be a little window of opportunity, she quickly closes it. That is the trait of a solid professional player. And this is what many would consider a must-get birdie here on this shortest hole of the course, Christine? I believe so. It's a 183-foot par 3. There is that creek that goes up the left side. Lydia did overshoot it by a little bit. Yeah, I, I like this distance because it's the distance you either take a full approach and back off of it or it's stretching the standstill distance for a lot of players. So She's in a very similar position to where she was yesterday. Yeah, not too bad. She's going to make it uh, very hard to catch her at this point. This was back on hole number four when she had the park job. That led to her third birdie of the round. And a beautiful oh. turnover by Aria. I feel like those are the similarities. That's one of the similarities we see with all four of these finalists uh, on our lead card today. All four of them, very, very firm putters. And that's exactly what we just saw from Aria. I've seen that for a number of years. Britt, certainly not shy on the green. Oh, short uh, this par four is. She actually has a decent angle to the basket. It's better to be off to the left side than it is the right. And we might get to see Aria open up on this one. Gets a nice, smooth turn out of that one. Barely even picked up her back leg on that shot. That was still a very controlled line. She's... And your leader, Aria Castrita with the T. That looks great. Parked. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, come on. What a round. So far, she has six birdies through 13 holes. She has pulled that right, but that got through everything. And I believe she's safe. This hole actually only has OB on the left side. There, Aria is putting up some professional level numbers. 965, 932, 981 in the third round with the incredible round. And she put together those numbers by making quite a few mistakes, to be honest. And I believe she... She's she's safe. Wow. She cut the corner and she's already <laughs> looking at the basket. And after
after quite some time sitting and just waiting. Arya having to reset. See if she keeps up her momentum. Uh, yeah. Wow. <laughs> Perfect. She must have played three or four games of chess during that backup. <laughs> See how much space she has with that tree. Wow. Uh, oh yeah. My gosh. I think that's gonna I think it's gonna work out for her. Great shot from Arya overall. Let's take another look at it. She's not distracted by the OB call that was uh, on the other side of the creek, puts it on a perfect angle, plays it just short for the skip to come up and hit the pole koozie. And Aria with a tap in birdie coming up here on 14. And Aria is at six under par right now, looking to extend the lead here. Just trying to get as much distance up the fairway as she can. There. No. Aria Castrida with what should be her last drive as an amateur disc golfer. Let's see an ace. <laughs> that sounds just tasty right now. Skip Karen. it in. I suppose a 20 footer for birdie is not too shabby. To win the championships, Arya Castrida, your champion at the NADGT. Yeah, the back-to-back -back <laughs> champion. It's time, Terry. You said it. The Open Division is calling her, and uh, I think she's gonna feel right at home. <laughs> And they will finalize scores. They'll get everything concluded. And it looks like she's going to come over and have a Ladies quick and chat. Boys and girls, it is my pleasure to introduce you to your 2021 National Amateur Disc Golf Champion, Female Pro Open Division, Aria Castruita. $2,500. Again, your champion, Arya Castrida. Congratulations to her defending the title and now moving into pro. But don't move anywhere. We're going to wrap it all up right here on the Disc Golf Network in just a few moments. Thank you guys so much for joining us. Stay tuned. Wrap up coming from Brian, Christine, and myself, and your champion there, Arya. We'll see you in a moment.